but the girls are you doing yeah deep voice <laughs> very deep voice yes we are in july yeah scarf and everything not just because george is here and the deep voice but anyhow we're gonna keep this video short okay i'm gonna save my life uh, my life <laughs> save my life i'm gonna save my voice you see what i'm saying okay what are they waiting for that's what we're doing today let's go straight in let's not even you know what i'm saying one two one two but number one what are they waiting for the star the king of cups and the magician well they are waiting that's for sure because they're on the fence they are on standby frozen full of love for you but they don't move they don't do nothing they say nothing what's going on here okay so what are they waiting for <coughs> excuse me george is very much here is maybe to manifest you again to re-manifest you because they're trying to play the illusion like they're cool, you know, everything's cool, nothing to say, really, everything is fine. But actually, they see you as a star. They see you as someone shining bright, beautiful, amazing, melting matter, doesn't matter. And you balancing your emotion in the meantime, okay? So what's happening here is they cannot stop looking at you, maybe thinking, I'm not good enough. Uh, maybe I should be um, richer, bigger, stronger, whatever. Well, actually, you don't care about all those things. What you're doing, you're shining bright. So whether they want to follow the path with you or not, that is not your decision, it's their decision. So what they're waiting for is to, <coughs> which is very much here, is to re-manifest you and get out of this position of non-action. Okay, so let's keep it short today, really. Okay, so I think it's straight to the point anyway, okay? So i just trying to work it out today. I love you unconditionally, absolutely. They love you and that the love they have for you never been the question. They really, truly love you. They're full of love for you. But at the same time, they might judge themselves as not good enough because you represent the light as another tunnel. Maybe they're still in a tunnel and they're hoping to re-manifest you in the future when they're out of the tunnel. Very possible, okay? So let's go to that third uh, deck here. We're going to go short today, I'm telling you integrity you bet be flexible but be also true to you stand by your beliefs and values and also will stand by and believe in you absolutely they have to really um shine bright like you do you know what you're about and you don't lie to yourself they they're not lying per se i think they're avoiding simply to to say something they stay on the fence maybe because they haven't you know, finish a relationship somewhere else and they don't want to treat you as a mistress or lover, you know, material, which is absolutely correct. And therefore they want to be, you know, um, noble. So integrity is a big deal and it's a big deal for you. Absolutely for you too. So I think they're right to maybe wait and re-manifest later when the situation is clearer, either because they finish a relationship with someone else or because they're actually more aware of who they are. Perfect. Okay. So part number two, what are they waiting for? Ten of Pentacles, Nine of Swords, and the Page of Pentacles. For me, uh, it's very clear here. We're finishing a cycle of life. We're going to get to the Ten of Swords. <coughs> it's cozy. It's cozy. <laughs> what? Excuse me. Sorry. Whatever. All right. Uh, they're almost finishing this. Uh, they're going to get to the Ten of Swords. So Nine of Swords is really thinking too much, not sleeping well at night. Also, we're well aware that when you have a Ten of Pentacles, you met and then you recognize each other and then you have a period of no communication. And then you come back together stronger as a power couple. So what they're waiting for is to go and, and finish this period here when you're in parallel. And at the end of the day, you're not already neither, to be fair. You're also doing your thing. Maybe you're dealing more with your career or whatever. And then you come back together. So what they're waiting for is for that reconnection here when they will present you with a golden coin let's start again but this time in a healthy way absolutely splendid so yes finishing a cycle of life understanding what happened to them not being so much in the mind but we still have to get to the ten of sword and then we have the ace of sword i know what i want and know what i don't want very clear so very straightforward here again thank god for that because the voice is not going to do it otherwise <laughs> okay so let's have this one we love this one don't we uh, a hide behind material things. Yeah, exactly. That is spot on. I mean, tarot is spectacular. Yeah, you're hiding between, um, between, uh, um, behind the, the, you know, the financial stuff, when the career, the work, the money, the whatever. It's fine. 
you absolutely aware that both of you at the moment maybe you have to do the same thing you have to deal with material stuff with maybe a problem with your career and stuff like that or simply yes yeah, someone may be a little bit too much into the material stuff but they know it's not um it's not their purpose they know it's just something they do but they're well aware that it's not the final destination the final destination is right there okay so and also if they were hiding behind material stuff at the end of the day they might actually find and, and bring the material the finances uh, for you to sort out um, maybe a project you have together at the end of the day you co-creating something at the end and it could also be with work so you know finances material stuff maybe it's for the project altogether so it's not a waste of time neither okay so all is well what do we have here sacred knowledge close your eyes and focus on your breath feel the peace within beyond your thought lies your eternal truth the i am presence of eternal love yeah it's all about clarity at the end of the day when you decide to start again it will be because you know exactly who you are and you're healthy within yourself both of you you're both doing the work and the knowledge is also when you go through a ten of soul nine of soul ten of soul you become an emperor and empress as i always say you don't become an emperor or an empress having a cup of tea and a biscuit so you have it so all is well on this note i'm going to stop talking and i'll see you tomorrow Mwah, ciao